thing the letter G. is exam one of five and it is pharmacology it's about um 8 30 and the exam starts at 10 30 so i just got here a little bit early to review some more so i'll check in with you guys after the exam bye all right exam one is complete farm actually wasn't too bad i thought it was going to be worse than what it was so Currently for uh, for this block of farm, we did uh, chemotherapy drugs, we did antidepressants, antipsychotics, and antiepileptics, and anticoagulants. So it was definitely a lot of drugs on this block, but the majority of the questions were like um, mechanism of action, um, knowing the adverse side effects, and the actual drug classes. So yeah, that wasn't too bad. And then tomorrow we have pathophys. Uh, for pathophys block, we're on pulmonary. And then we have two exams on Wednesday. And then the last one is on Thursday, with this, which is pathology. So I'm just going to look. I'm going to go ahead and start studying for pathology. Not start. I've been studying, but um, start doing some more review for that, even though it's on Thursday, because it's, it's a lot for the path exam. And then later in the afternoon, I'm going to do some um, pathophys. <laughs> Good morning guys, so it is now Wednesday. Yesterday, I'm pretty sure I just took the hardest exam of the year. Pathophys was crazy. Um, so our exams are cumulative. So even though we're on the pulmonary unit right now, we still have past things on there like renal and cardio. But I felt like over 50% of the exam was renal. It was just way more difficult than it needed to be. Today we have two exams, um, micro is first and then we have um, psychopathology and that's just like a lot of disorders to memorize like depression, bipolar, different psychotic disorder, personality disorders, anxiety disorders, but um, Picmonic has really been helping with memorizing that so we'll see how it goes today. Taking two exams, it's only Tuesday but I feel like it's Friday, <laughs> I'm so tired. Hey guys, so I'm done with uh, those two exams. I'm back at my apartment right now. I'm in the um, I'm in the conference center in the leasing office. This is where I come to study sometimes. But yeah, micro went good. Micro is is I'd say the easiest class that we have. So that those exams are usually not difficult. And then psychopath, yeah, it was a lot of disorders on there. It was a lot of um, pharmacology on there. So I mentioned I was using um, Picmonic to study for that and it was pretty helpful. That was one of um, the resources I mentioned in one of the vlogs I did like at the beginning of the year about what resources I was deciding between and yeah, Picmonic, I use it here and there for certain things. So if you're not um, familiar with Picmonic, it's pretty much like a visual aid that helps you um, memorize topics, study things, and they have like all different kind of like subjects like, you know, biochemistry, pathology, physiology, farm, micro, um, you know, a lot of different topics and the videos are like two minutes long. So it's a real quick sketch and then it's good with memory. I use it a little bit during, um, during first year, like it helped me with like memorizing the cranial nerves for neuro, 
but then i didn't like have a subscription so it was just like um you can only like see a few of the sketches um and then you had to like restart the next day but i went ahead and bought the uh the subscription at the beginning of second year and it, it's been pretty useful so yeah they pretty much have like the different systems like i'm looking here pharmacology micro path um biochem and then let's, let's just click on this um behavioral so yeah, so you can see it's the pharmacology section, pathology, um, biostats, so antipsychotics is an example of what I needed today for the exam. And so you can like play one of these, and this one is one minute long. And then this is just the sketch that you see. And then we also had to know about the mood disorder, so they have different um, pigmonics for that. Like this is the schizophrenia assessment. This is almost two minutes long. But yeah, it's very good memorization. You can use it like throughout your courses. And let's say like physiology, for example, if you wanna um, know like the heart murmurs, these are all the things listed like aortic stenosis, just really quick to help aid you like throughout while you're going through the course. This one's like a minute. So yeah, I think it could be useful um, throughout first and second year material because they really cover like all the subjects and I think one thing that'll come in handy for me is like when I'm studying biochem for step that's literally just like a lot of memorizations and if you go to the biochem section you can see like they have all the um, gene deletions they have like the nutrition section on there vitamin things that are pretty much just like rote memorization so little pigmonics here and there can really help like solidify those kind of things in your head and then like as far as like price when you're comparing it to other things like um let's say sketchy medical because that's kind of similar they have sketches pigmonic is way cheaper than um sketchy sketchy is really good but pigmonic is like way cheaper and they have like a lot more options as far as subjects it's not just farm and micro it's like all the ones that i mentioned previously so yeah if you're like having difficulty with memorization um or even just like needing a tool to help solidify things that you're learning as you're going through the courses i recommend um checking them out they do have a free trial Trial that you can see uh, to see if you like it. But I have one more exam to tackle pathology. That's one of the difficult ones. Uh, we're on heme right now. We have a lab portion and we have the lecture portion. So I'm going to be studying both of those uh, for the rest of the night. Um, since tomorrow's Thursday and it's the last exam, we have a three day weekend. So I'm definitely looking forward to that. Good morning guys. I'm not even sure how I am awake this morning. I got like three and a half hours um, of sleep last night, but I'm wide awake and I am ready for this last exam. Oh, and yesterday when I was discussing um, Pygmonic, I forgot to mention you can get 20% off if you use the, um, the link below. If you register and subscribe with that link, you get 20% off. So, all right, heading into the last exam now. Alrighty guys. The exams are done. The lab section was pretty hard. The lecture section section wasn't so bad. And as y'all can see, I'm at the um, airport. Since we have a three-day weekend, I'm going to visit Stanley this weekend. Typically, the weekend after exam week are the weekends where like you really don't have to study. So I try to take advantage of those weekends. But this week has been so exhausting. Um, so I'm happy to just finally get a break this weekend. Yo, it is freezing in here. Oh my gosh. Just landed in Illinois. My face is so cold. Um, but yeah, I'm going to go ahead and end the vlog here. And I'll see you guys in the next one. If you enjoyed the vlog, please give it a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe if you haven't already. Bye.